this is possibly not hugely thrilling content, but if you enjoy organizing things like I do, you <laughs> might get into this. So this is my makeup drawer. And since we moved, I got rid of my old cardboard boxes that I used as dividers. So everything's just been chucked in here into some different categories, but I think it's a bit messy. Uh, and as you can see, lots of lipsticks. It's um, yeah, not at all organized really. So I have had this delivery just now of divider organizers that I wanted to get from Amazon. And I'm gonna attempt to organize this situation. Right, so I've just unpacked all of this. So essentially you get in this particular set and they had a bunch of different options on Amazon. Um, three big containers. However many of these, six little tiny ones, which I actually don't know how useful that's going to be. But I guess we will play around and find out. And then you got six of these containers. One of mine was broken. So I wonder if we can email them and get another one. And then six of these mid-size containers. So really I am not sure how many sets of these I'm going to need. Um, we kind of just thought oh, I could measure it all or I could just order one set and give it a try and see what fits the best way with all of my makeup and then order more if I need to. So we're going to give that a try right now. Um, I'm basically living in my pyjamas at the moment, uh, mostly because other things are very uncomfortable. I'm 38 weeks and two days and she is getting, that's like, <laughs> I can sort of show you the bump. She is getting heavier and heavier. So I've kind of, until I'm ready to get dressed the early part of the day, uh, pajamas is it. Um, Cause actually some of my lounge wear is just not all that comfortable at the moment because the bands at the waist are um, a bit tight. And yeah, this one is a really big set uh, of linen pajamas from Messi Messini. Um, from the memo and yeah, I'm just living in it. It's so comfy comfortable. <laughs> I'm actually not sleeping in it. I'm just sleeping in a big um, t-shirt uh, Because I didn't really want to get all the like oils and moisturizer that I put on every night on this set So I basically wear this big t-shirt overnight while I'm sleeping and then I change into this first thing in the morning and stay in it for a few hours and oh my god it's so cozy <laughs> I love it anyway so I'm gonna crack on with these drawers and pull all the stuff out and suss out what I'm doing <sighs> um this is our guest room where I keep my clothes and accessories and um makeup and hair stuff uh and we are about to install some curtains so that is why the ladder is my backdrop today <laughs> because uh, Mario was trying to install these curtains the other day with um, like a short step ladder and we have really high ceilings and the, the curtains are like probably about 2.4 meters long themselves or no they I feel like they're longer but anyway he was trying to install the curtain uh, rods up and the brackets about three something meters um, with just the step ladder. And I was like, just go and buy the ladder, <laughs> please. We need a ladder for so many other projects that I've had on his like to do list that he hasn't been able to do. So he actually went and spent like $250, $250 on a massive ladder, which I am hoping will last the rest of our lives because <laughs> it's just not something you want to repurchase again um but yeah then it got too late at night for him to finish off this room so we've got all the bits and pieces all right so we've kind of had mixed success 
show you what I've got so far. Like eyeshadow palettes and stuff, which there's obviously, again, that's a terrible angle. There's obviously tons because I'm obsessed with eyeshadow palettes and they, I'm such a sucker for them. I buy so many. <sighs> I buy way too many. So yeah, there's, there's like a ton in here. I probably could put that into two drawers at some point. So we're kind of like part organized, part not organized. You know what? This blush bronzer drawer is feeling great. I started out so well. This will be better when I've got brushes. <laughs> Stay positive here. I don't actually have that many eye products, mostly because the shadows are up the top. And I don't have that many um, nail polish. I mean, I probably do. I just got a bunch more nail polish. That goes all the way back. So there's about three or four different brands of nail polish that I like. And I've just collected a couple of colors. I don't even... I just can't even, these aren't even in order. There's, I think that's what's putting me off. There's so many lipsticks, like, so, so many, and it goes all the way back. I love lipsticks so much, and yeah. <laughs> I can't part with lipstick. Other things I give away, but lipsticks I usually just keep, so. That is what this situation is all about. <laughs> I'm going to need to buy some more containers. I don't even know what to do. Uh, then we have... This one was a bit of a nightmare. So this is my, like, foundations. Um, basically, those are tinted sunscreen or BB creams. Concealer. Fixing sprays and primers. Back there is where I've put all of my like mineral powders. Don't use them very often, but I suppose I use the ones that I've got at the front more. So foundations, I do use these powders more, so at least I can reach those. Yeah. So and then I've got an eye primer and some sponges. I didn't end up having room for. This other little container of sponges and brushes in that section, which kind of doesn't make sense. But then I do have, and then I've got cleaners for those um, sponges as well. Um, but then I do have this random drawer of perfumes that I don't wear too often and some gifts to give away, uh, which I can obviously reconfigure later. And down the bottom here, this usually has my Dyson hair accessories, but I'm, I've got that out to shoot with today. Then I've got my chargers for my corral, Dyson corral and stuff. Hair scrunchies and stuff and ties. These are mostly from Slip Silk, which is my favourite. Um, and then I've got like hair bobby pins and stuff like that. So this is like just hair drawer. So Mario is just readjusting my wardrobe after we got the final drawers. And I've been waiting for this pull-out tray here. I've been waiting for two of them, but now I think I just want one. Um, and then we put the glass shelf. So he's just readjusting where the clothes rack goes. Here is me today. 39 weeks and 5 days. 5 days. The apps just tell me I've got 2 days to go. So here is an update. I think it works pretty well without having that extra shelf. And we just lifted that one up a bit. So, for now I've just popped some of my perfumes here on this little tray and now, now that I've worked out what fits, I need to get more of the IKEA um, 
insert dividers <laughs> for these so that they're not just in old shoebox lids and that will reconfigure and I think I'll actually space out my jewellery a bit more because that is that is a mess <laughs> so I might get another one of these and then something that I can put all of the other bits and pieces in obviously wasn't wearing them during pregnancy and yeah that is all of that now complete I'll be interested to see if I want more denim <laughs> then coming back up here I have more handbags and then boots shoes and just more boots and down here I've got like a row of tiki's and then more tiki's and then more heels sneakers low heels sneakers and a mixture and it's roughly the same on the other side again this is really hard for me to show maybe it'd be better when I can go further back but at the moment I can't kneel on the bed because my belly is in the way <laughs> um, as I film this so handbags Shoes, boots, mm, kind of boots, a couple of slippers there, low heels, sandals, and then sneakers. And I've got a spot right down the bottom for another video pair that I have my eye on. <laughs> and that's it. Done. Complete. Not allowed any more shoes after that. <laughs> So this area is finally feeling more put together. Mm -hmm.